The Sukhoi S-70 Oconic B, also referred to as Hunter B, is a Russian stealth, heavy unmanned combat aerial vehicle being developed by Sukhoi and Russian Aircraft Corporation MiG as a sixth-generation aircraft project. The drone is based on the earlier Mikoyan SCAT, designed by MiGAN, encompassing some technologies of the fifth-generation Sukhoi Su-57 fighter jet. In the future, it is planned to act under the control of pilots of Su-57 jets, similarly to the USAF Skyboard program. The OKB Sukhoi's Hunter B, the first Russian heavy drone, is made according to the flying wing aerodynamic scheme. The takeoff mass of the machine is about 20 tons. The device is equipped with a jet engine. According to the military, the drone has anti-radar coverage and is equipped with equipment for optoelectronic, radio engineering, and other types of reconnaissance. As it was then reported in the military department, the flight of the device took place at an altitude of up to 600 meters around the airfield. The drone was controlled by the operator from the ground. In the video, Hunter steers along a strip of a military airfield, then takes off and maneuvers with an unmade landing gear, after which it makes a full time landing. The characteristics of the developed UAV were not disclosed. According to open data, its takeoff weight will be 20 tons, which will make it the heaviest of the developed devices of this type. It was reported that for the first time, it will take off in 2021 and in 2022 will be adopted. The purpose of the research is to create an unmanned reconnaissance and strike system that would have a high speed and autonomy. Hunter is characterized as unmanned aerial sixth generation machine. It is known only that in the Hunter B, it is planned to use the technologies of the prospective heavy fighter T-50 PAKFA. The mass of the UAV is in the range of 20 tons. Based on the data on the takeoff weight, it can be assumed that this drone will be close in its characteristics to the American drone X-47B development Northrop Grumman. It can fly at high subsonic speeds, operating within a radius of 4,000 kilometers, carrying a diverse target load, including a shock, with a mass of up to 2 tons. The Okotnik has a top speed of 10 kilometers. The drone is highly autonomous thanks to its AI brain. What's more, some of its technology and ammunition have been borrowed from. The S-70 Okotnik may be somewhat on schedule. It has already passed one important test this summer when it successfully fired precision ground attack missiles at practice targets. Of course, this news is released by Russian state-run media, so it is not entirely reliable. But it is safe to say that this unmanned combat vehicle will enter service in numbers in the next 12 to 24 months if it can acquire spare parts and computer chips that are in short supply due to Western sanctions. There is a war on, and priority is being given to the Russian army, as it calls up conscripts and rushes to produce more tanks and armored personnel carriers to face Ukrainian counterattacks. The Okotnik will have to ensure that it receives parts that are being limited by international sanctions, particularly computer microchips that are in short supply with Russian manufacturers. The Okotnik has a flying wing design, and it is big for a combat drone much larger than American combat models, such as the Predator and Reaper. The engine is likely the AL-31 or 41F, the same power plants that are on the Su-27, Su-35, and Su-57 fighters. This gives the S-70 a combat range of 2,485 miles. It can cruise along at 421 miles per hour. The unmanned bird also has a large payload at 4,409 pounds. Weapons are carried in two internal weapons bays. The Oconic has been flying since 2019, so UAC has run it through its paces since then. UAC has likely used other American combat unmanned models for inspiration, 
such as the Boeing Loyal Wingman Drone Air Power Teaming System, Northrop Grumman's Hax 47B, or Lockheed Martin's RQ-170 Sentinel. Although the first prototype's exhaust nozzle was conventional and could increase the drone's radar signature, future upgrade could see improved exhaust as well as engine inlet as shown by a mock-up the 2022 Mega International Aviation and Space Salon.